go for an on-time liftoff. Let's listen into the terminal count and watch as Falcon 9 takes our 49 Starlink satellites into a 53 degree south inclination orbit. T minus 30 seconds. T minus 15. T minus five, four, three, two, one. Lift off. Stage one chamber pressure is nominal. plus 45 Power seconds into liftoff and Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off from launch complex 39A at Kennedy Space Center, carrying our stack of 49 Starlink satellites to low Earth orbit. Now moments ago, we did throttle down the engines in preparation for Max-Q, and that is maximum aerodynamic pressure. Max-Q. And there's the call out that we just passed through Max Q. That is the largest structural load that the vehicle will see throughout ascent. Now coming up, we will have three events happening in quick succession. That'll be main engine cutoff, or what we call MECO, stage separation, and second stage engine start one, or SES one. MECO is where all nine of the M1D engines shut off and slow the vehicle down in preparation for stage separation. And back engine chill has started. And that's just a call out that the uh, engine chill on the second stage is getting ready uh, for ignition. Stage separation is where the first stage separates from the second stage, and with first stage returning back to Earth for landing, while stage two continues on its journey with the third event, SES-1, or second stage engine start one. And that's where the MVAC engine ignites up and propels the second stage along with the Starlink satellites to their targeted drop-off orbit. We're just about 10 seconds or so away from those three events, and they will be followed by fairing deploy shortly after SES-1 as well. Nico. Stage separation confirmed. In recognition. separation confirmed. We have got some great views, all four of those events that I mentioned, Miko, stage separation,